howdy howdy everyone um it's dark out i think it's like it's shortly after five in the morning and i'm out it's shortly after five in the morning i'm on the way to work and i gotta take the bike it's like minus five right now but the high today is supposed to be up into like almost double digits So that'll be cool. And I decided I'd record a little bit at night. I don't know how it's gonna look. I doubt you guys are gonna be able to see much of me riding at night, but I'll probably record uh, after work on my way home, hopefully. So I'll probably see you guys once I'm done work. It is beautiful outside today. It is like, eight or nine degrees like it's probably almost double digits outside temperatures Ugh, I'm so itchy I spent all day at work today 10 hours lifting insulation and strapping it onto a tank for 10 hours of today so I'm a little itchy but at least I'm on the bike and it's a great day to be riding though things are a little damp but like I just got my riding jacket a long sleeve shirt and a hoodie and jeans and I'm comfortable so far. It's so nice. The roads are all wet though so my pants and boots are probably going to get pretty damp. It was a cold ride this morning coming in here. It was like, I don't know, I think it was like minus 12 when I left my house. When I got to work, my boots were a little damp from the day before, like they didn't get dried out overnight and they were like solid as a rock from the ice freezing. <laughs> that dude just giving me like going ham with the dual high, or er, not high fives. He had like dual thumbs up, man. He was going ham. Ice freezing. <laughs> I wonder if that made his day. Dude, he's creating a lot of splash. He's getting me all damp. Oh, it's so nice to be riding. It's just like spring so close to coming. I can taste it. I can taste riding season coming back. I kind of wanted to try going down there. But I don't know how much trouble I'd get in. Because, like, they're putting in a pipeline down there. So it'd be like, could they get mad at me for going down there? Probably. I can ride my motorbike. I can ride my bike. I almost guarantee you I've been stuck behind this same van on this same road in my truck before. And if I recall correctly, I think I know the road he turns down. And I think the road he turned down before was just before the passing lane. I like when people have bumper stickers on their vehicle, but they're too small. Like, even from, like, where I am right now, I can't read what his bumper sticker says. Like, I literally have to be, like, right behind him at a stoplight to actually read what it says. It kind of defeats the purpose. IMO. My goddamn mic isn't, like secured it's not secure so uh it's moving around and bothering me hashtag moto blog problems i can't think of anything to talk about right now like there's a van in front of me i'm uh, i'm on a road yep. The van just turned off. Smooth sailing. <laughs> Woohoo! That was spicy. <laughs> I found an icy spot. I forgot. I always forget that this part of the road is always icy and slushy. I always forget that every time. Cause I'm free! 